Recognition is the backbone of success for every endeavor and organization. And the college rides on that premise to motivate its staff, students, and selected alumni to continuously excel in the fields of undertaking. Ladies and gentlemen, I wish to use this occasion to express our heartfelt gratitude to the university management, especially our own, the Vice Chancellor, for her massive support, assistance, and encouragement for the college in all endeavors, including programs, activities, requests, initiatives, etc. I also appreciate all the funders, sponsors, and donors who helped in diverse ways to improve our service delivery in the areas of teaching, research, and community engagement. I think that it is good, it is in order, that the college can set aside a time like this to at least grow our culture of celebrating our own. It is a good thing. So I applaud the College of Health Science led by the Provost for this. And I think that we can do that for them now, can't we? We're about to start with the awards. We still have more awards to go, ladies and gentlemen. We want to rush through. And remember that uh, staff awards um, will be given out and a lot are expectant. So still in the student category, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Professor Jocelyn Dobe, the Vice Dean of the School of Medicine and Dentistry. I'm, I'm the co-chair for the committee that, that uh, organized this event. So it's an event that we are going to be organizing every year to inspire the people who work very hard on our teams and our staffs. It's very important that we inspire our students and, and our workers so that they'll continue to work as much as they always do. The management of the College of Health Sciences decided to organize this College Excellence Awards to motivate both students and staff for the various roles that they are playing in the, in the college and for that matter the university. As you may be aware, the, university, the college is doing so well when it comes to the various mandates of the university. And as a college, we deem it fit for us to recognize them at the college level just to motivate staff so that they can give their best in whatever they are doing, including teaching, research, and community engagement. My name is Eva Peters, a final year disability and rehabilitation studies. And having been actually awarded this particular award as the best innovative student for this year, I'd like to say that this in recognition of my contribution to the College of Health Sciences 
this would go a long way to drive me towards maintaining greater heights and achieving greater terms in terms of success and more progress. Thank you. My name is Malbi Magdalene and I've been awarded the best overall best community engagement student. I'm a final year disability and rehabilitation studies student and it means a lot to me to have been awarded with this. Actually one of the things that the VC said today was that appreciation also calls for appreciation, which means that once I have been recognized with this award, it definitely calls me to ask and do more things that would also improve upon the status of the School of Public Health. Once again, thank you so much for this award. So, I am Dr. Benjamin Kisitasu, a veterinary doctor and a product of School of Veterinary Medicine of KNUSD. I am winning the best alumnus of the year in the School of Veterinary Medicine comes as a great joy to me. I believe that every level of achievement is a stepping stone, but not a destination. Um, one of the awards was for research, the other was for service. But the thing with uh, awards, especially for research, is that it's done by a team. So really, this award goes to the hard-working team that I have, the Global Health and Infectious Diseases Research Group, as well as the Global Health Department at the School of Public Health. Really, this award is for the hard-working team, and I happen to be the face of the team. And so it's really a great honor and uh, happy to be recognized for the great work that the team is doing. Yes, I've been chairman for the ceremony this evening. Uh, but for me, the most important aspect of the evening, for me, I've been the, I'm the immediate past provost of the College of Health Sciences. And it's always important to see how the college develops and goes on. And this ceremony shows me that the strategic plan this college drew up um, about two, three years ago, in terms of how we are going to go for the next five years, is some of what this current provost is seeing through. People come, they abandon strategic plans, okay? But what the provost has done this evening shows that our strategic plan as the College of Health Sciences is being followed through. Tech TV, experience educational television.